Guys, Andy Quinn here. We're back with Young Royals episode two. Episode one was good. It was fast paced. Got to the point in the story. Um, I like was it Willie, William and um, Simon. I think they're pretty neat. Um, I'm curious to see how things are going to develop because obviously a lot of people want William's attention because having someone that powerful uh, be quite useful to the other rich kids. I like seeing Simon arguing with another rich pampered kid about taxes. I thought that was funny. Forward to see where they're going to take this. I think it's going to be. An interesting watch and because it's been so short as well it'd be quite fast so look forward to like a begin the story quite fast because the pace is going to be quite interesting for sort of short shows but uh, i'm curious to see where it goes and i'm curious i, I look forward to seeing more side characters as well what side characters i'm going to grow to what sam and sister's name ah uh, this is where amazon comes in handy so cold to her I love how he's trying. He glances at him and tried to say hi. Oof. Neat. Fair play. I like how we've got like someone who try he's like learning this, the way he's here. <laughs> hey William got William got to talk to him though. <laughs> he tried. How much is it? Yeah, but how much does that cost in the parents? Yeah, but how much is the invoice? How much is the invoice? Oh, God. Why don't you ask for help to teach her to be te taught the ways? Communication. Nah, jealousy is too powerful, though. Oh, you're going to ask? Come on, ask for help. There we go. Communication, asking for help. Jealousy doesn't help. I go see like Fleece's character growth is going to be interesting. I feel like those two are going to be quite big side characters. And obviously Simon and we'll be the mains. Uh, and then we got that other guy. <laughs> Oh, he's got ambition. I think he'll be proud of him. That's such an aggressive Ikean. <laughs> I just want Simon to do well. Seeming. Seeming. This guy wants to be the very best. He is basically just Ashkashim. Oh, he got that follow! And the mess about. <laughs> Intense is a one way to describe him. Oh, fair enough. Oh, a bit of sympathy for him there. 
Oh, he's motivated to go now. He's his boy there, Simon. Oh, no, plank kid. <laughs> My worst enemy. Ooh, a new played. <laughs> Ooh, salty because you can't get the drugs. Uh, or medication doesn't take technically. Mate, leave him alone. Yeah, fuck you. <laughs> Oh, for God's sake. Oh, he's going to... No, oh, for God's sake, this guy. Oh, it's so cute. <laughs> you probably took an interest in him, honey. Oh, the football match. Uh, okay, so he's keeping his promise then. Well, he said he'd try. August is scary though. <laughs> That's so intense. He's so psychotic looking. He'd be a fantastic murder or psychopath actor, I think. And you know, uh, in like a murder show, I think he'd be great. Perfect. He's got that atmosphere. <laughs> Maybe it's just a character. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think it's all really good so far. Same playing like awkward teens as well. Can he escape August? Follow him like a movie. <laughs> Let's take a public bath transport. Oh, yeah, forget everyone knows where he is. Why can you not just have contactless payment on buses? That's what we got. It's fucking out. When they changed everything to contactless, that was great. I'm about to make a friends with a prince. Surely he needs guards to be out, though. To be fair, I wouldn't be surprised if he's being watched. <laughs> Man needs a decision. Hey, that would be a good relationship. We've got indecisive someone who's decisive. I can see the chemistry there. <laughs> He's getting grilled right now. That was a fast hot dog. To be fair, because it was... that's so tiny though. Like that bun though. <sighs> I'm no good at football. I can't even kick one for the life of me. Oh shit, weren't I giving away? Oh, that's going to give him away that he was out. I don't know if it's showing August is following him. August is going to be in his. But as soon as he opens his eyes, August is going to be like, Where was you last night? <laughs> Thought you was ill.
It's always going to be in there ready. I guess people need to know where he is on top of that as well. I guess he's ten. I guess he's also got to be careful of um, because obviously he's, in, he's put in charge. Where if any happens, well, he screwed it. <laughs> people change. <laughs> It's good arguments. <laughs> uh. Uh. <laughs> Social media have actually asked sometimes. Yeah, it didn't seem fun. Oh God, this guy's got no money, has he? Oh man, his whole life is around this school. He's got a similar situation, like, you know, like, not saying it's equivalent to prison, but yeah, people who've been in prison and the whole life around around it. And when they leave, like, in Shawshank Redemption, they want to go back because there's nothing on the outside. I feel like his whole life, he's, he's, he's tied his whole life into this school now. And it's like, oh, if that got taken away from him, I think that would break him. He's an interesting character. As much as I make fun of him being terrifying, he's actually quite complex. And I quite like that. He might not be like usual, like, he's not that usual character you like root for and stuff like that but he's at least he's probably the he's, so far he has the most depth like Will you and Simon are very trop, tropey characters and you're very usual William's like a prince who's been, been sent away to born in school and Simon's like usual the poor kid going to a rich kid's school whereas like he's like seems to have a lot more depth to him and I actually quite enjoy that now I look forward to see where he takes take his character Your man's, uh, what's it? What's the word called when you like not having as much? Ah, oh, rationing. I didn't see her doing it. Mate, you can use it to blackmail you massively in the future. Don't do it. Don't trust Izzy. He, like I say, he, he'll use anything you use get against anyone if it better helps you out. Uh, he, just setting yourself up for him to use it against you later. That's any problem. Oh, illegally selling drugs to students. I can get you kicked out of school. It's like, ugh, fuck. Uh, 
<clears throat> Plus, well, that's for the money that he owes you. Well, they're different kind of own machines. Now, Sai, if you don't give him them without the money first, my guy. He knows how to play. He's, he, ah, oh, he knows what he's doing, don't he? Let's <laughs> get your money. <laughs> Just, I'm just wants to ah, the mother, that's it. I'd see a hot fight break out. Look at William makes moves. He doesn't. Sl this guy not a slow mover. So two hand holding, we're doing well. I guess you got the mistake in the name. I don't want to. I assume it's anxiety. I'm not quite sure. Of that. Oh, God, these both are very forward. It's quite funny. It's great. Oh, cute. Oh, bless. Oh. <laughs> Imagine it almost been on top of that room. Oh, dude, it's just so awkward, mess. Say that's. Oh, that's the end of the episode. Oh, I was waiting for, I was waiting for my boy. Oh, so uh, how's the episode? I, 
I don't know if we've been, I don't know if it's mentioned if he has an identity or something along with this team land. Like, again, out of the room. Um, then, like, yeah, grabbing him, pulling back some good ones to go away was quite cute. Uh, I don't, like I say, I'm going to, with August, I've been, tra- he's by far the character I've been interested in most, just because he's got a lot going on. Don't get me wrong, he's a dick, but, um, they're giving him reasons to be, I make him a bit more layered than your typical, uh, character, like him, and carries character archetype, so I like the idea, like, he's obviously, his dad committed suicide, his mum's just disappeared, um, He's clearly money has been cut off. His whole life revolves around his school, especially because he took uh, such a leadership role. He's, he's taking it, um, and then like he's got like permission. I guess I've, a lot of it, he takes a lot of responsibility. So I'm curious to see how he goes about his character. And he's obviously got a little addiction. He's got addictions. Well, on top of that, I know he's got to keep up appearances and come across as perfect. So he definitely is an interesting character. While also yeah, being a bit of a cunt, but it's just like yeah, that's the way it is. Um, yeah, no, he's pretty cool. I actually quite like his character. Um, so yeah, uh, Felice. I don't know what to think of Felice. I'm going to keep seeing. I'm I'm glad she's trying she's trying to work on the jealousy side and maybe try and work with um, uh, Simon's sister. I forget her name, but Simon's sister is also a pretty cool character. I quite like her. I just thought she has huge merits as well, and I'm sure every character seems like they're going to have a lot going on, especially because of those years as well, where lots is going on. And then William being as forward as he is, and I like the whole little indecisiveness and decisive decision that was made with the hot dog as well. It's kind of cute to show sort of the chemistry and what the potential chemistry they're going to have. And yeah, no. And then, uh, yeah, I'm glad he went to his football game. He didn't just skip it out. I think that was pretty cool. And then we got uh, then we got the school stuff on top of that. And then we got some... Li- I like how Richardson li- leaves little tidbits as well, leading for other episodes. So like stuff like the invoice, that's not going to come... And sometimes like both shows are trying to resolve that in this episode, but it seems in this show they're setting up a little, they've left something for them to be resolved in the next episode. I like that. They've got stuff like the money, which is going to carry over to the next episode. And I like that there's little storylines that are not being resolved in the episode. They're actually like leaving them that can cause more problems or build up. So the story clearly knows how to build up its story as well. And it's not just about the romance, there's other stuff going on as well, which I really enjoy. But yeah, very good second episode. I enjoyed that. That was very good. We'll see a Patreon quickly. So that, I was quite surprised how quickly that was over. Um, we only got one comment, but it says, Sophie Port, it's normal to, pr- uh, to say prayers before dinner at this kind of school, even though people don't do it at home. But in Denmark and Sweden, I assume, are Christian countries, so the traditional school does it. The closest thing to a school like this is the one show in Denmark is uh, Hussum. Um, the Crown Prince children were about onto at least in the boarding school. They were in public school before, but there was revealed to be a scandal at the school, so the royal family backed out. Um, it's a huge deal, lasted the media for years, um, last year. It's such a privileged school, so it's to discover that the things that went on in there were wild. So even though Augusta's words were, of course, extreme, they were true to some extent. That goes for all places in life. Money and status by silence. That is a very true saying there. No, I really enjoyed that episode. That episode was really good. I, I'm looking forward to see where they're going to take these characters. I don't know, awkward teens watching them just try and find themselves and um, uh, discover who they are. I always love watching. Um, and I look forward to see how that romance is going to progress, especially with the sort of, the sort of atmosphere they're around as well, the whole life, just being like on media as well with the prince, which is going to be interesting. And yeah, no, I look forward to seeing where they're going to take this. But that's it for this.